Hi, this is Keith, and I want to introduce to you our handy little crosshatch angle checker. Now you ask, why do I need to check my crosshatch angle? It's got one, it's in there, and you know what? That's right. Your engine wants it, your engine needs it, but like everything else, it needs to be the right angles, the correct angles. If we get the angles too flat, we can get into blow-by problems, we can get into ring chattering problems. If we get the angles too steep, too vertical, too up and down, we can get into ring rotation speed problems. We can get into oil migration problems. Flatter the cross hatch is, it reduces blow by, but at the same time as we flatten, oil wants to go left to right, side to side, not up and down. So very important that we get the right angles. Now when you hear the terms 45 degree cross hatch angle, that's your very common cross hatch angle for most Typical V8 engines, most four cylinders, just about everything out there runs a 45 degree cross hatch angle. And that is what is known as the included angle. It is the angle between the ascending and descending cross hatch line. That's kind of difficult to measure in a cylinder unless you're using a, a tool like a USB microscope. It's very easy though to measure it off the deck, off the top surface. And then we're measuring a simple angle from the flat surface down to the cross edge, which will be half that number. If we're looking at a 45 degree cross edge angle, this angle will be 22 and a half degrees. So we're going to take this simple tool, angle checker, we're going to put it in our cylinder, or in this case in a sleeve that we've got here. We're going to line the zero angle up with the top of the deck. Keep in mind, I can't see it very well from where I'm at. And we're going to look at that angle coming down on that cylinder, and we're going to match it up, we're going to line it up with the lines on the checking card. The corresponding line is our angle off the deck or off our horizontal axis. So in a typical, again, application, you know, V8, most applications, you're looking for something in the 20 to 22 degree angle, which would be double that in your included angle. I have quite a few customers that will use this and cut it to their desired angle as a quick reference, so it's always handy to have at least a few of these in your box.